Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Metal Storm. Today we're going to be covering stages 5 and 6 of Expert Mode. And we're going to be doing it very quickly. Thanks to my practice with stage 4, I got to be fairly good at doing the gravity flip to avoid attacks. And you can use that to dodge most of the lasers in this part of the stage, which allows you to take a lot of big shortcuts. And we, we really are past the difficulty hump in the game right now. I mean, these uh, the last part of the game definitely is a challenge, but it's nowhere near the level of what we were fighting against before. Here, the main challenge is dodging these lasers, which there are a ton more of than there are in the, uh, the normal mode of the game. Uh, some of them are placed in, in ways that you will get hit by default if you are uh, in the wrong spot of the screen when you're moving forward. So a little bit of cheap difficulty there. Uh, once you learn their placement, that is probably the hardest part of the whole thing to be able to time that correctly. But this level really is not that hard, and uh, especially if you have this gravity power up, uh, which I finished the last level with, so I got to take it with me. This section can be a little bit tricky. There's a lot more of the laser firing enemies. So uh, if you don't time it appropriately, they will spawn a lot of lasers that are hard to dodge. But that's already done. And we are uh, actually already almost through with the level here. There's only a couple more traps to fight. Or to get our way through. Sorry, I'm not the most articulate at the moment. I'm pretty burned out on this game right now, I'm not going to lie. But we're going to see it through. All right. This armor power up here, I don't know if that's even possible to get in expert mode. Uh, you really could only get it with the shield in normal, but uh, here I just don't know. And we're going on to the boss. Uh, this is the hardest boss in the game in normal mode. I, it's pretty hard here too. I actually resorted to this little trick since I had the gravity power up. Uh, if you stand on the very edge there, you can deal a lot more damage to it with uh, this attack than you could normally. It does take some practice to be able to uh, do this without dying, but it does take down the boss much, much more quickly than you could do with any other method that I have found. I spent a long time banging my head against the wall trying to beat it with the normal shot, and then I discovered that that would do it much more effectively. And we're just going to go straight on to level 6 here. Um, as was pointed out in the thread, there are some pretty drastic differences between the American and Japanese versions of this level. Um, the Japanese version actually has an insta-death barrier on either side of the screen. But I'm not playing that version of the game, and I'm going to take advantage of that by just running through here as quickly as possible. Because other than that, uh, the differences between the normal and expert modes of this stage are pretty minimal. Uh, the main difference comes in the, difference, uh, in the scrolling gimmick which in the first half it changes direction every time you flip and the second half whenever you're touching a solid surface the screen will scroll in the direction that you're currently facing uh, other than that the enemies have more health but it's almost exactly identical and I might make a bonus video showcasing the uh, Japanese version of the stage as I said I'm really feeling like I'm ready to be done with this game at the moment uh, so I might not be doing that but, uh, you never know. I might come back later. Took some damage from invisible spikes there. But I had the armor power up, so that's okay. And we're at our boss. And, uh, just like the level itself, the actual, uh, approach to this boss is exactly the same as it was. Uh, the only difference is that these guys have a lot more health than they did in the normal mode. You'll notice the first one is already almost dead, uh, but I think uh, each subsequent one's health goes up exponentially. So I'm just going to speed this up a little bit. Because really if you're good enough to get to this point in the game in expert mode, this boss will basically be a joke at this point. Um, more tedious than anything, but it's done. And now uh, we are actually coming up to our final stage in the game, which I will be going through next time. And I'm looking forward to it. Doing a little boss rush and uh, saving the world here. All right. 
Well, uh, thanks for tuning in, everybody. And uh, come back next time when we will finally finish this game off. It's only been like a week. Whatever.